current shifted once more, carrying him along with the unseen mass beneath the surface. He felt a fleeting touch against his leg, a brief chilling brush. Something shared the water with him. A sudden jolt nearly knocked him off his feet. Then, out of the murky depths, a shape emerged, its immense size staggering. He could scarcely believe his eyes. Before we embark on this captivating journey, we kindly invite you to show your support by engaging with our content. Please consider giving this video a thumbs up, subscribing to our channel, and leaving a thoughtful comment stating, I've subscribed. Additionally, if you find this story as inspiring as we do, don't forget to share it with your loved ones. Your support means the world to us. The Spanish Canary Islands, with the vibrant La Mera as their jewel, are famed for their breathtaking vistas and exotic creatures. This archipelago just off the African coast lures travelers with warm Atlantic waters and pristine beaches. Yet, hidden beneath the inviting waves lies a secret, a creature destined to become a whispered tale among locals. Joel and his family were basking in the sunshine at Grand Ray Tourist Resort. While the Atlantic's cool embrace beckoned him, his parents kept him within the designated safe area. Little did they know, the seemingly tranquil water held an unexpected encounter that would be forever etched in Joel's memory. Unbeknownst to them, a watchful eye captured the unfolding scene. As the drama in the water unfolded, the camera began to roll, unknowingly recording a moment that would soon explode on YouTube, propelling Joel and his experience into viral fame. Fish scattered in frantic bursts as the sea creature surged toward Joel. A sleek fin sliced through the water's surface, drawing gasps from the onlookers. Black, glistening skin breached the waves, then vanished, leaving only a chilling stillness in its wake. The bewildered crowd could only wonder what lurked beneath. Suddenly, the water churned again. The black, alien-like form emerged, impossibly close to Joel. It brushed past him, knocking him off balance. Fear jolted through him. Something unidentifiable grazed his skin. The onlooker's shouts echoed across the water. Get out of there! Watch out, it's a shark! But a flicker of understanding crossed the boy's face. This was something else entirely. Back on the safety of the steps, Joel's fear turned to fascination. He had to know. The immense creature broke the surface fully, slowly hauling itself onto the lowest step. It was almost close enough to touch. Now, viewers caught their first glimpse of its true magnitude. Water cascaded off its glistening oil-black form as it emerged from the ocean, revealing a colossal body easily spanning four meters. It was undeniably a manta ray, yet so much larger than anything Joel had ever imagined. But what did it want? Was this gentle giant a threat, or was something else at play? The giant manta ray dwarfed the young boy, easily triple his size. Shouts of, get back, filled the air again, but Joel's reaction shocked them into silence. Gone was the fear, replaced by a radiant smile. Don't worry, he called out. She's friendly. Joel knew just what to do. The crowd gasped as the manta ray opened its immense mouth, a gesture that looked menacing, but was, in fact, expectant. Fearlessly, Joel placed his hand inside, then opened his fist. Only when his hand was safely withdrawn did the creature's jaws close around a hidden offering. A wave of awe and relief washed over the onlookers. This was a sight none of them would ever forget. The mystery deepened. How did this remarkable encounter unfold? This particular manta ray, seemingly unafraid of humans, had developed a clever strategy to secure a meal. It would boldly approach tourists, who, after the initial surprise of encountering such an elusive creature at close range, found themselves drawn into its feeding ritual. Joel, fist clenched around a snack, cautiously offered it to the colossal animal. The manta ray, in a gesture some interpreted as gratitude, flapped its fins gently. After circling the harbor for a few minutes, the enigmatic creature returned for another petting session, accepting another offering before gracefully gliding back into the ocean depths. This wasn't Joel's last interaction with the manta ray, however. In the fishing harbor of Vos, where this incredible story unfolded, manta rays were a familiar sight. These majestic creatures often trailed boats, hoping to scavenge some discarded bycatch. But it wasn't always a relationship built on trust. Superstitions about manta rays lingered among seafarers, 
their formidable size and strength could intimidate even the most seasoned sailor. Some whispered that even spotting one at sea foretold misfortune, or that they possessed the power to sink a ship by dragging at its anchors. Yet, a shift in perception occurred in 1978. Off the coast of California, divers began documenting their encounters with manta rays, revealing a placid nature at odds with the fearsome legends. The world discovered that these enigmatic creatures posed no threat to humans, shattering centuries of misconception. The rise of social media brought these fascinating giants into the spotlight as people began filming and sharing their encounters. The economic incentive for protecting them became clear. While a hunted manta ray might fetch a paltry $500, a live one attracts tourists and generates an estimated $1 million in its lifetime. However, not all encounters with marine life in the peaceful waters of Wham, Massachusetts were idyllic. A mysterious creature lurked in the depths, causing a stir in the local town. The police station was flooded with calls reporting sightings of a large, menacing sea monster. The situation was baffling. Some callers described the creature with hair-raising detail, while others saw it splashing around harmlessly, even expressing concern for its well-being. Its movements were unlike anything they'd seen before. Theories ran wild. From an injured seal to a vicious shark, no one could even begin to imagine the truth that awaited them. Determined to get to the bottom of this, Buckminster dispatched two DNR officers to scour the cove and locate the mysterious creature. They soon spotted the bizarre fin that had sparked the town's alarm. The culprit? A sunfish, with its clumsy, erratic swimming giving it a deceptively fearsome appearance. The officers reassured everyone that the sunfish was unharmed and simply demonstrating its unique swimming style. Unfortunately, panicked calls from unknowing tourists continued to flood the station. A public statement was issued, pleading with visitors to stop reporting the harmless sunfish. The creature became a source of amusement for the town and also sparked important conversations about the sunfish itself. Our oceans are under unprecedented stress. Climate change, overfishing, pollution, conservation efforts are more vital than ever. While stories like Joel's and the sunfishes make for entertaining tales, they also shine a light on the need to protect these creatures. The more people come to understand and appreciate these animals for their gentle nature, the better equipped we'll be to safeguard their future.